Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm Mrs. C and I'm here to do another review for you and today it's going to be a review on the Victoria's Secret Bombshell Lotion and Perfume. I got both of them. The reason why I got both is because I was doing the deal that they had where you bought the perfume and you got the lotion for free. So this was a freebie. And then the lotion, the deal, the reason why I got it, because it was $79 for the perfume. And then I had a $20 off coupon. So I used it. So it was $59 for both the perfume and the lotion together because it was this was free. So I got both. The reason why, too, that I even went this route and decided to give it a try because I've never had Victoria's Secret um, perfume before. I have gotten like the body sprays, like the body mist and the um, lotions that kind of went with them because they did that like sale. I think it was like five for 30 or something like that deal. And so I got those and I've given those a try. I was not a huge fan. I, I felt like they were a little bit stronger and lasted just a smidge longer than the Bath and Body Works products. However, I felt like the Bath and Body products were just a better deal and I like their scents better than I did on the body sprays from Victoria's Secret. Now, however, when it comes to the lotion and this perfume, I absolutely love it. I am definitely an outdoorsy kind of girl. Um, I enjoy being outside working, pulling weeds, um, planting flowers. Like, obviously, as you can tell, I've gotten <laughs> definitely a little sun going on. Um, but I enjoy working outside in the summertime, especially. And I guess I put on lotions in the morning. It's just one of those things you get up and you get showered and I just put on lotion. And I feel like Bath and Body Products, which don't get me wrong, I absolutely love the scent notes. Like I have several of the Gingham Gorgeous. This is one of my favorite scents right now from them. And I will do a review on these later. But I love them, but they just don't last. Like if I go outside, and it's hot, especially if you go out and like you're at a softball game. I feel like you just won't end up smelling it. Like I feel like my sweat overpowers the lotion, but not with this. I felt like I can put this on and when I go outside and I start sweating, like I can smell my lotion. Like that's what I smell. It smells so good. Like I just absolutely like I love it. So and the perfume as well like I can spray this on and it will last me all day like you will smell this all day however if you do like the body mist from Bath and Body Works this is one of those you got to keep spraying keep spraying keep spraying so you a lot of people will say well Victoria's Secret so expensive but really when you think about it I'm I probably have like four of these bottles and four bottles of lotion and four bottles of the body wash so that hopefully it'll last me and I can make it through. So at the end of the day, you're kind of spending close to the same amount of money as you would on the perfume and the lotion. But I love them. So, and I love the consistency. I don't know if you can see, but like the lotion is a lot more like, I don't know, more moist, I guess. It really just absorbs into the skin. It's more of a wet, um, like, consistency you can see like just how it just kind of goes on and just absorbs right into the skin and it's more of just a I don't know I guess more of a just smooth goes on and it feels really good and smells amazing however like the gingham gorgeous I feel like it goes on a lot more like kind of thick see look how that's even oh hang on there you go how it's just coming out so thick I mean look at that so it's very like thick lotion I mean even like rubbing it in like look at how it's like I don't know I feel like that looks really chunky and it's uh, see I feel like I'll be putting on this lotion forever I probably got a little too much but I don't know it just takes it a little bit to absorb in and not saying it's bad quality because I absolutely love um Bath and Body Works lotion and I love their uh products too but I don't know I guess I just this now trying it, I really like it. And this will probably be something that I will continue to purchase. So I would highly recommend this Bombshell, which supposedly is like their number one. Um, and I don't know if I mentioned that the scent notes on this one are White Peony, Sage, and Velvet Musk. So that is the scent notes on these. I would highly recommend. I think these are a good one. I think they're a good winner winner. Catch them on a good deal. Like I think right now too, they're even having these at like $39.95. So you could give them a try then. 
um, and see if it's something that you like. But I, I like the deal. I thought that wasn't a bad price to get the bottle of lotion and the perfume because we all know I even have Bath and Body Works for their actual perfume. It's pretty pricey. So I think just watch for when they have sales and give it a try. But I love, love, love the scent notes. So I would highly recommend the Bath and, or Bath and Body. Now I'm Bath and Body Works. The Victoria's Secret Bombshell. I would definitely recommend both of these, pairing them up and you will smell beautiful all day. You'll get lots of compliments that you smell good. My husband absolutely loves it. He comes up and he's like, mm, you smell good. But when I wear my gingham gorgeous, he always makes fun of me and goes, you smell like summertime. That's our new joke around here is I smell like summertime. But anyways, that will be all on the Victoria's Secrets uh, bombshell lotion and perfume. I will be back. I'm going to be doing actually a review on the gingham gorgeous line and in those scents. So I will be back on the next one. Till then. Bye.